screen for becoming a teacher. I believe in that. I worked for it. And today, God has officially made me a teacher. My name is Vinny Ang. I'm an English teacher in one of junior high schools in Central Java. This is my second year working as a teacher. And I'm so surprised because the fun part is what I told when I was kids about teaching's job for delivering the lesson, explaining what I'm dancing to my students in regards to retiring the past different, asking them for finishing evaluation and getting score. However, it's really, really contrast to what is happening right now. Teacher's job is more and more than that. It is not installed for academic achievement or student score. We, as a teacher, has a responsibility for transforming a student becomes a human being. Teachers must make an impact to their students. The impact is not always quick. Maybe we can help them for finishing their endless tasks, listen to them for sharing it, and everything that can touch their heart. That's why being a teacher is not easy. But being a teacher is such a terrific and valuable experience. I'm often questioning myself. Have I given my students enough provisions? Have I engaged to them? Have I helped them find their relevance? And the last question that comes to my mind is, what makes a teacher great? For answering it, I must repeat the question to all my students in grade 9 in my schools the WhatsApp group, and I got some surprising answers. First, funny of course, touches my heart so ways. It's awesome, critical, and meaningful. They say, every teacher has their own ways to teach. That's why every teacher is great. Yes, because every human is different and unique. They also say, a great teacher never demands assignments to their students, but it's impossible. How could it be we don't give any assignments to our students? The third one, great teacher never gives a video project. This answer came from one of my students named Shiva, and that was the story behind this. Like usually in the morning, I came to the class, great the hello, good morning everyone, how's life? And everything we have discussion in the classroom, and then on the lesson I gave them an assignment for making video for a chat, regards to introducing themselves in English. All the students were shocked and shouted, No this, no video for a chat, it's really hard! They shouted clearly and loudly. But at the end of the time, only few students who collect the video punctually and the rest really. One of them was shaking. And the last answer is, a great teacher can be a friend with their students. Yes, and I learned how to be their friends. I learned the language, popular culture, slang words, jokes, and everything that is happening around them. Even, I learned about mobile too. I learned from Korea, like BTS, TXT, Treasure, and I'm sitting with 23 men studying over there, and I just realized that they are super, super talented and exactly handsome. That's why almost all my students fall in love with them. Because me, I do the same. Since from that, I always try to connect and engage to my students. When I connect to them, they will be closer to me and more open to me. They tell us everything, share me many things. So I can create humble learning atmosphere in the classroom as a result the learning process can be run From all the answers, I got one thing. Children are children. They teach me more than I know and expect of them. I also realized that great teachers handle their students. They should engage to their students. When we teach them, we also learn something from them. Although nowadays, actually, they talk totally to not need a teacher as a deep understander of academic knowledge because they have internet in which they can access many things over there. What the students need is a teacher as a deep understander of the students.
the one who can trust them that one day they can be the one who can empower others. A person who can trust them that they are good students. A teacher who can be a hope for sharing. Students need to be listened and understood. Let's imagine if all teachers want and will listen to their students. The responsibility for transforming a student becomes a human being or a person or even our society can be really happen. The future is started from our classroom. So, the answer for the last question, what makes a teacher correct? The answer is not engage, listen, and understand our students. Thank you.